Hello everyone, in this video I will be talking about Autosas Secosi module and its working. I will be specifically talking about Secosi module of Autosa architecture and it is mostly related to automotive companies who work with Autosa. Let me give a quick introduction on how this Autosa architecture came into picture. Many automotive companies, suppliers and software industries decided to have a common software platform and thus they decided to partner in developing this standardized automotive architecture. What is SecoC? It is abbreviated as Secured or Onboard Communication. As of now, the automotive companies were sending data from one ECU to another ECU without any security via CAN bus. Any, anyone who has an access to CAN bus can read and tamper the data. Due to these uh, increasing uh, attacks, inclusion of uh, SecoSi to the data communication becomes important. This SecoSi module is present in Autosar architecture to protect the in-vehicular communication. So this SecoSi module can be integrated to any of the automotive communication networks like CAN, Ethernet, etc. It helps in adding security to the outgoing message and helps in achieving integrity and authenticity of message. This is an architecture given in Autosa Secosi specification document available online. The link for the specification uh, document is provided in the description below. As you can see, the Secosi is in line with the level of PDUR. So PDUR routes the incoming message to Secosi to add security information to the PDU. So whichever communication stack involves PDUR in it, Secosi can be implemented. Secosi module in turn gets services like crypto algorithms, keys, etc. from CSM that is Crypto Service Manager and Crypto Modules. Communication stack for CAN and Ethernet with Secosi looks like this. We have a demo application in the application layer and the flow of outgoing message is via COM to PDR. PDR routes the plain message or data which is called the authentic IPDU to Secosi module. The Secosi performs required MAC operation with the help of CSM module and sends back the plain text plus freshness value plus the authenticator which is the message authentication code to PDUR. This is collectively called secured IPDU. PDUR then routes the complete secured IPDU to the lower layers depending on the communication protocol that is scan or Ethernet. Now let us look how does the Secosi work. Consider two ECUs, ECU1 as the sender ECU and ECU2 as the receiver ECU. ECU1 consists of a MAC generator which can be any algorithm based on AES. The inputs to this MAC generator are the data, key and freshness value. Freshness can be a counter or a timestamp. MAC is generated out of it. This is how it is appended to the outgoing secured IPDU and sent to the receiver ECU. At the receiver ECU, that is ECU2, the verification process happens this way. The key will be uh, already stored in the internal memory of uh, each ECUs. So the MAC generator gets the input that is the data and freshness value from incoming message and generates the MAC again. It will verify the MAC with the received MAC for correctness. If it does not match, that particular message will be discarded. If it matches, the message or the data is said to be non-tampered and will be sent to the upper layers. As we know, the CAN protocol has 8 bytes of data frame, which is limited and appending these security information may lead to having lesser data, lesser space for data. 
So there is a feature called secured PDU collection in Secosi where we can configure to send data and security content separately. But when, uh, when verifying the data, both the messages should be received at the receiver end. But in case of Ethernet, since there, are, there is no restriction for the data length, we can configure to send all the information in a single message. This was a brief explanation about Otosa Secosi and its working. Let me know how was it in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe this channel for many more videos which, which will come up on automotive embedded systems. Thank you so much.